the reason that we use the words wide awake is because scripture talks about what it means to be wide awake. And here's what I love. Here's what it says. Ephesians 5, 13, Paul writes, but when anything is exposed by the light, it becomes visible. For anything that becomes visible is light. Therefore, it says, awake, O sleeper, and arise from the dead, and Christ will shine on you. Look carefully then how you walk, not as unwise, but as wise, making the best use of time, because the days are evil. Seizing the moment, Bethlehem Church is a story of Christ shining his light upon us, of a fresh move of the Holy Spirit, of years of faithfulness, of being a church that has a bias to lean forward and not look back. So every weekend it takes seven to 800 volunteers spread over two campuses serving in multiple areas. And so there's a big thank you. There's a, uh, just a real heart of gratitude because of people who come and give themselves away. That the reality that as we invest in the next generation, that we give our first and our best, that we have incredible student volunteers, incredible children's ministry volunteers, that we believe that what we experience when we gather together as adults, that our kids experience when they gather together to worship Jesus as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you, because the church isn't about the four walls, it's about the people living and thriving and being Christ's light in our community. Being a church that's wide awake means that we're to reach people nobody else is reaching. We gotta commit to doing things nobody else is doing. And it's been a cool thing at Bethlehem Church is that we've just given ourselves to taking new territory, whether it be our Midtown, our fourth and fifth grade ministry. Uh, that's taking brand new territory and seeing God do an amazing, amazing work. Whether it be our student ministry that's calling out the future leaders. Strategically, what does it look like for us to, in our place, in our space, and the time in which we live, to leverage our influence to serve the next generation? To give our first and best to creating environments to strategic leadership and thought. When so many things are pulling at the next generation, what does it look like to be a refuge? What does it look like to be a place that's fighting for the next generation and sharing the gospel of Jesus Christ uh, with the next generation, inviting them to make an impact now? Whether it be our community ministry and, and new initiatives that we help get off the ground like New Path, what does it look like to be a church that's more committed to being a movement? That, that more than just one campus, more than just two campuses now, but what does it look like to be Bethlehem Church of four and five campuses? What does it look like to be strategically positioned to be a church, a movement, not a location, not an institution, but a movement of people propelled by the Spirit of God, placed in communities to serve the community, to be for the community? What does that look like to be a church in multiple locations? That's what we believe it means to be wide awake. That's the story of Bethlehem Church. It's been because of people's faithfulness, thanking uh, people for their generosity. They're going above and beyond giving, investing in the next generation, that we're a church that believes the next generation is the generation now, that we should put them on the platform at the church, that we should serve and give our best to the next generation, that we are placed not just in a community, but we're a church in our community to be for our community that our area should be better because the people of God are here. Bethlehem Church is a story of people's faithfulness, not just now, but for years. And so we live and we go into the season and the truth of Ephesians 5, as Paul is saying, that we live wide awake. The opportunity before us, the opportunity before us that God has been faithful and that as we look to the future, we look with our hands wide open and our eyes wide awake to what God has for us.